Top 5 Cutting Edge Chinese Missiles That Stun the U.S. and the World In recent conflicts, the U.S. has poured trillions of dollars into military campaigns from Iraq to Afghanistan, with Afghanistan alone draining over $2.26 trillion without achieving lasting strategic goals. Missiles like the AGM-158JASSM and Harpoon AGM-84. Deployed in exercises or to support allies in the Indo-Pacific, have failed to maintain America's once-and-rivaled edge. Meanwhile, China, with its razor-sharp investment strategy, has surged. Ahead, emerging as a global leader in the technology arms race, developing next-generation missiles with unparalleled precision and power. China is not only building a modern arsenal, but also reshaping the security landscape of the Asia-Pacific leaving the U.S. scrambling to keep up. What are these game-changing? Weapons. Join Top 10 Discoveries official as we unveil the top five. Chinese missiles hailed as technological marvels that are redefining global power. DF-41. China's ultimate global strike missile in its journey toward defense modernization. China has made remarkable strides, and the Dongfen-41, or DF-41, stands as one of its most prominent achievements. This advanced intercontinental ballistic missile ICBM showcases China's technological prowess and strategic vision in safeguarding to national security and maintaining stability. The DF-41 boasts an impressive range of 12,000 to 15,000 kilometers, enabling it to reach distant regions worldwide. From North America to Europe, its standout feature is the multiple, independently targetable re-entry vehicle MIRV technology, allowing it to carry multiple warheads, each capable of striking a separate target with high precision, achieving a circular error probable SEP of just 100 to 150 meters. This reflects a significant leap in guidance technology, it's combining inertial navigation with China's domestically developed BIDO satellite system. One of the DF-41's key advantages is its exceptional versatility. The missile can be launched from mobile platforms on specialized trucks or from fixed facilities, enhancing rapid and efficient deployment. Publicly unveiled during the 2019 military parade, the DF-41 has become a symbol of China's robust defense industry growth. Affirming its position in missile technology, the DF-41 is currently deployed at strategic bases in northwest China, such as Qinghai and Xinjiang, with an estimated 5280 launch platforms. Designed to support a defensive strategy, the system ensures flexible response capabilities in critical scenarios. Some reports suggest China is exploring innovative deployment methods, such as rail-based launches, to further diversify the missile's operational flexibility. With its combination of range, precision, and versatility, the Dongfen-41 is not just a technical achievement, but also a testament to China's efforts to build a modern defense force, it's contributing to global strategic stability and balance. DF-17, the hypersonic titan, redefining warfare in an era of relentless innovation in military technology, the Dongfen-17, or DF-17, has cemented China's position as a pioneer in hypersonic weaponry. With its exceptional speed and agility, the DF-17 is not only a symbol of technical prowess, but also a testament to China's commitment to safeguarding regional security and contributing to strategic stability. The DF-17 is a ballistic missile. Integrated with a hypersonic glide vehicle HGV, it's capable of reaching astonishing speeds from Mach 5 to Mach 10, 5 to 10 times the speed of sound. With a range of 1,800 to 2,500 kilometers, it can cover critical areas in the Asia-Pacific. From the South China Sea to surrounding waters, unlike conventional ballistic missiles, the DF-17 follows a low-altitude trajectory and can maneuver dynamically, optimizing its ability to strike targets with high precision, thanks to advanced guidance systems combining BIDO satellite navigation, active radar, and optical sensors. First unveiled at the 2019 military parade, the DF-17 captured global attention with its cutting-edge HGV technology. 
enabling it to evade many advanced missile defense systems. While nations like the US and Russia are also developing hypersonic weapons, such as the USA GM-183 ARRW, or Russia's Avangard China, has already deployed the DF-17 in operational settings, showcasing its remarkable development speed. This positions the DF-17 as one of the world's most advanced missile systems. Affirming China's leadership in this domain, launched from mobile transporter erector launchers tells, the DF-17 offers superior flexibility, enabling rapid deployment. In areas like China's coastal regions or strategic bases, recent reports as of 2025 suggest China is testing new variants of the DF-17 with an extended range of up to 3,000 kilometers, enhancing its responsiveness in regional defense scenarios. Designed to protect national interests such as key maritime, routes in the South China Sea. The system supports China's proactive defense strategy compared to similar systems. The DF-17 stands out for its combination of speed, precision, and mobility. While US hypersonic missiles remain in testing phases and Russia focuses on nuclear armed systems, China's DF-17 is versatile, capable of carrying both conventional and nuclear warheads, making it suitable for a range of tactical and strategic scenarios. This gives China a technological edge in the Asia-Pacific, where countries like Japan and South Korea are also investing in missile defense. With its superior capabilities and rapid deployment, the Dongfeng-17 is not just a technological breakthrough, but a symbol of China's innovation and determination to build a modern defense force, contributing to regional balance and stability. HQ-219 China's impenetrable missile defense shield, the Honki-19, or HQ-19, stands as an impressive milestone, affirming China's leadership in missile defense technology. As a long-range air and missile defense system, the HQ-19 showcases China's innovation and determination to build a modern defense force, contributing to national security and regional stability. Designed to intercept targets at ranges from 620 to 1,860 miles, 1,000 to 3,000 kilometers. The HQ-19 can counter medium-range ballistic missiles, cruise missiles, and certain hypersonic vehicles. Utilizing kinetic hit 2 kill technology, it destroys targets through direct high-altitude collisions in the atmosphere, delivering optimal defensive efficiency. Its advanced active electronically scanned array AESA radar enables simultaneous detection and tracking of dozens of targets at distances of hundreds of miles, ensuring rapid responses to complex threats. Deployed in key areas such as Beijing, Shanghai, and bases in Tibet and Xinjiang, the HQ-19 serves as a robust shield, protecting China's political, economic, and military hubs. It operates within a layered defense network, seamlessly coordinating with systems like the HQ-29 and Russia-supplied S-400 forming a multi-tiered, highly effective protective barrier. Compared to renowned systems like the US, that, or Russia's, S-400, the HQ-19 stands out with its indigenously developed AESA radar and impressive interception range, achieving superior technological self-reliance. While the US deploys THAA in allied nations like South Korea and Japan, and Russia focuses on exporting the S-400, China's HQ-19 demonstrates its ability to build a defense system on par with global leaders, tailored to protect its territory, developed. Since the 2000s and successfully tested around 2018, the HQ-19 has rapidly become a cornerstone of China's missile defense strategy. Recent reports as of 2025 indicate ongoing upgrades to counter emerging threats, such as advanced hypersonic vehicles. Its integration of domestic technology an interception range of up to 1,860 miles. It positions the HQ-19 as not only comparable, but exceptional among global defense systems, underscoring the robust growth of China's defense industry with its precise interception capabilities and flexible deployment. The Honka-19 symbolizes China's ambition to build a modern defense force, contributing to balance and peace in the asia pacific region. YJ-21. The hypersonic spear of China's Navy China continues to assert its dominance with the YJ-21, or Eagle Strike 21. 
A hypersonic anti-ship missile dubbed the Sharp Spear of the Chinese Navy, designed to protect strategic maritime routes. The YJ-21 is a testament to China's innovation and technological self-reliance, contributing to security and stability in the Asia-Pacific region. The YJ-21 boasts astonishing speeds of Mach 8 to Mach 10, approximately 6,100 to 7,600 miles per hour, making it one of the fastest missiles in the world. With a range exceeding 620 miles, 1,000 kilometers, it can cover vast areas in the South China Sea, Western Pacific, and beyond. The missile employs a solid rocket motor combined with a ramjet engine, enabling sustained hypersonic speeds in its terminal. Phase, paired with an advanced guidance system integrating BDO satellite navigation, active radar, and infrared sensors. This ensures high precision, with a circular error probable of just 33 to 66 feet, 10 to 20 meters. Even against moving targets like warships, primarily deployed on the advanced type 055 destroyers. Among the most powerful warships in the Chinese, Navy, the YJ-21, enhances the protection of critical maritime routes. Recent reports as of 2025 indicate China is testing its integration on Type 096 submarines and H-6N bombers, expanding its range and flexibility. Compared to other anti-ship missiles like Russia's 3M22, Zircon or the USS SM-6, the YJ-21, stands out for its combination of hypersonic speed, long range, and multi-platform compatibility. Showcasing China's remarkable advancements in naval technology, while Russia prioritizes speed and the U.S. focuses on versatility, the YJ-21 strikes a perfect balance. Meeting the needs of strategic maritime defense, developed from the DF-21D missile platform, the YJ-21 was publicly revealed in 2022 through Chinese Navy test videos demonstrating precise strikes on simulated sea targets. It is a critical component of China's maritime defense strategy, safeguarding national interests in areas like the South China Sea and the Taiwan Strait, capable of carrying conventional or fragmentation warheads. The YHA-21 is optimized to counter high-value targets, ensuring China's strong presence in international waters with its superior speed, impressive precision, and flexible deployment. The YJ-21 symbolizes China's naval technological prowess, reinforcing its national standing in the region and on the global stage. CJ-210 China's precision strike masterpiece in an era of relentless defense technology innovation. The Chengjin-10, or CJ-10, stands out as a symbol of China's remarkable advancements in cruise missile technology. With its precision strike capabilities from long distances, the CJ-10 is a testament to China's technological prowess and strategic vision, contributing to national security and promoting stability in the Asia-Pacific region. The CJ-10 is a TA land attack cruise missile with an impressive range of 930 to 1,550 miles, 1,500 to 2,500 kilometers, tabling it to cover strategic targets across the region. Traveling at subsonic speeds of approximately 500 to 560 miles per hour, 800 to 900 kilometers per hour. It flies at low altitudes of 33 to 164 feet, 10 to 50 meters, evading enemy radar and enhancing its ability to reach targets. Its advanced guidance system, integrating Bado satellite navigation, inertial navigation, and terrain contour matching TURCOM technology ensures high precision with a circular error probable of just 16 to 33 feet 5 to 10 meters. The CJ-10 can carry a conventional warhead weighing around 1,100 pounds, 500 kilograms, or a nuclear warhead. Offering flexibility for various defense scenarios widely deployed across China's Army, Navy, and Air Force, the CJ-10 can be launched from mobile ground platforms, warships like the Type 052D, submarines like the Type 093, or H-6K bombers. This versatility sets it apart from other cruise missiles such as the U.S. Tomahawk or Russia's Kalibor. While the Tomahawk is extensively used in U.S. global operations and the Kalibor is a cornerstone of Russia's Navy, the CJ-10 excels due to its multi-platform integration and China's technological self-reliance. From its turbofan engine to 
its domestically developed guidance systems, publicly unveiled at the 2009 military parade. The CJ-10 was developed starting in the 1990s, drawing on some technologies from the Soviet KH-55, but significantly enhanced by China. Variants like the CJ-10A with extended range and the air-launched CJ-20 demonstrate continuous innovation. Recent reports as of 2025 indicate China possesses hundreds of CJ-10 launch platforms, thousands of missiles, ready to support defense strategies in areas like the South China Sea and the Taiwan Strait with its long range, high precision, and diverse deployment options. The Changjin 10 symbolizes China's defense technology prowess, reinforcing its role in maintaining regional balance and peace. China's technological might and strategic vision. The remarkable development of China's missile systems has sent shockwaves across the region and the world, fueling an intense arms race in defense technology. With their combination of long range, capabilities, hypersonic speeds, and pinpoint accuracy. These weapons not only bolster China's strategic position, but also reshape the security landscape of the Western Pacific, particularly in sensitive areas like the South China Sea and the Taiwan Strait. China's A2AD, anti-access area denial strategy lies at the heart of these missile systems, creating a vast no-go zone in the Western Pacific. With the DF-17 and YJ-21, China can hold U.S. bases in Guam, Japan, and South Korea, as well as American carrier strike groups in the region, at risk. The CJ-10 and DF-41 provide precision strike capabilities and nuclear deterrence. While the HQ-19 serves as a robust shield against counterattacks, this strategy is designed to deter U.S. intervention in potential conflict scenarios in the South, China Sea or Taiwan Strait, giving China a decisive strategic advantage. The blend of speed, mobility, and multi-platform deployment of these missiles has significantly complicated the defense plans of the U.S. and its allies, forcing them to invest heavily in cutting-edge technologies like directed energy weapons and space-based sensors. The defense technology race in the Asia-Pacific is more intense than ever. With China's DF-41, DF-17, HQ-19, YJ-21, and CJ-10 posing formidable challenges to U.S. and allied defense systems. Yet, with robust investments in new technologies and international cooperation, the region is witnessing a new strategic balance, where security and stability hinge on the ability of all parties to innovate and collaborate amid a world of constant upheaval. These missile systems are not just symbols of technological might, but also a bold declaration of China's unassailable dominance in the global defense technology race. From the Dongfang 41 with its staggering global reach of 9,320 miles, 15,000 kilometers, the DF-17 blazing at hypersonic speeds of 7,600 miles per hour Mach 10, the HQ-19 guarding the skies with a 1,860 mile, 3,000 kilometers, interception range. The YJ-21 ruling the seas, to the CJ-10 striking with pinpoint accuracy of just 16 to 33 feet, 5 to 10 meters. These systems showcase China's extraordinary innovation and strategic vision in safeguarding national interests and ensuring stability in the Asia-Pacific region. But what lies ahead? Are secret labs in Qinghai or Xinjiang? Brewing the next breakthroughs poised to reshape the global defense landscape? How will powers like the U.S. respond to overtake China in this high-stakes technology race? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated on the latest insights into technology national strategy and innovation shaping the future. Top 10 Discoveries official will be back with untold stories, boundary-defying creations, and silent revolutions that ripple across the globe. I'll see you in the next video.